Hello, kindergartners. It's Miss Lessard. Happy Friday. Today, we're going to do a 2D review, which I know you know your 2D shapes, but we're also going to be reviewing how many sides and how many vertices they have, and then we're going to have some real fun making some with things you have around your house. So let's do a quick review. Okay. What shape is this? I hope you all said triangle. All right, how many vertices? Remember, vertices is the fancy way of saying corners. So there's one, two, three vertices. And how many sides on a triangle? One, two, three. You got it. All right, this has equal sides. What shape is that? I hope you said square. How many vertices? Let's count. One, two, three, four vertices. And how many sides? One, two, three, four. If you said four and four, you are correct. All right, let's look at this shape. Okay, what shape is that? I hope you said rectangle. Let's count the vertices. One, two, three, four. Four, just like the square, but two or longer. That's what makes it the rectangle. Let's count the sides. One, two, three, four. Very good. Let's do one more. Ooh, look at this. What shape is that? I hope you said hexagon. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. And let's count the sides. One, two, three three, four, five, six sides. And I just want to remind you these two shapes, which we're not going to do today, do not have vertices and do not have sides. Let's see if you know what they are. The circle, that's right, that's zero. So we're not going to talk about that one today. And then there's this one. The oval also has zero. So we're not going to talk about those. Today we're just looking at the shapes that have sides and corners or vertices. Okay, now we're gonna to get to make those with fun things around your house. So, for the triangle, you're gonna need three items. And for the others, you're gonna obviously need more. You need four, four, and six if you wanna attempt the hexagon. Oh, my six went away, let me fix that. Okay, so let's start with the triangle. You can use toothpicks for your sides, straws, coffee stirrers, anything that's straight. I'm using toothpicks, so if you have toothpicks in your house, try those. Now, for, to make the vertices and connect them, you can take Play-Doh and make little balls to connect them. I don't have Play-Doh, so I used gummy bears. Check it out. And look at my triangle. So any kind of sticky candy would work. Okay, and I just took the toothpick and pushed it right into the gummy bear. The gummy bears are my vertices, or my corners, and uh, my toothpicks on my sides. And again, you could use Play-Doh and make little balls and that would connect them. You could do mini marshmallows, that'd be fun. Don't have mini marshmallows, but I do have the big ones and I made my square using the big, <laughs> big marshmallows. And all I did was take my four toothpicks and push them into the marshmallow. How fun is that? So look around your house Decide what you're gonna make. I'd like for you to make two. I did the triangle and the square. You can attempt the rectangle or attempt the six-sided hexagon. That'd be kind of hard, but I'd be so impressed if you did. Have fun, happy Friday, and enjoy your shape making, guys. Bye.